Greetings all, it's Blue Knight, and welcome back to Persona 3 F.E.S. Previously, we hung out with Nozomi and finally learned more about this paradise, as well as he wants us to enter paradise too, because apparently he thinks we're worthy of doing so. Though we left on a bad note with Nozomi at the end of our last meeting with him, I'm still iffy about the guy. Furthermore, we hung out with uh, Akinari and learned that he's almost done with his book. And that uh, apparently it's impossible for him to be saved because he was going to be admitted to the hospital, but apparently there's nothing that they could do about his health. So today, we're going to continue with more social league business after we go on Koromaru. And we're going to put more of a focus on Nozomi as he's pretty much going to be the only social league that's going to be available to us as we meet Fukichi going forward up until next Sunday where we hopefully will have time to hang out with Akinari once more. It's been a while since we've seen Fukichi. It's been so long since we maxed out his social league along with Mitsuko. Well, those two are doing pretty well for themselves. Now it transitions into the late nights. It's getting a phone call. From Mitsuru. That's surprising. Do I have time to talk? Um, Mitsuru, I don't think it's gonna be in the cards tonight. So sorry, but I'm gonna have to turn you down. Besides, if you want to ask me about to hanging out together, just come downstairs and knock on my door. I know that cell phones make things more convenient, but still, we're not that far from each other. I was surprised if it's true of all people would straight up call us like that, very casual like. I know we've been friends with her for a while, but it's still surprising knowing her and her character. As Winter Break continues, we only have one socially we hang out with we can hang out with, like I said before, but winter vacation will be wrapping up soon. So I'll have to make the last few days of this break count before the school year starts up again. So as it's the 4th of January. I was thinking about going to check on the recording console again, but I think it's too soon, so we're gonna hold that off for a couple more weeks at best. Have you seen the headlines? And the ones about Mysterious Colton Town, the end is near. Oh yeah, and mix it with all of our social shenanigans, there's this cult that might be worshipping Nyx, more or less. We've seen the markings around town since December. We didn't know where they came from and who was behind all of it. Probably might be related to this cult that's been growing as of late. Let's get more info on the news. A man has been arrested for his attempts to recruit others into a suicide ring. The detainee was an unemployed 30 year old intensely devoted to cult related magazines. It might not be related to the cult that we've been hearing about, but that's still very unnerving to hear. There's a cult posters over, over town. They haven't done anything since. I think everyone might be saying the same thing from last time. That cult did, what a mess. Pretty sure it's just the same info. Yeah, it is. Gonna hang out with Nozomi then by just hanging out for the day. Actually, the series near the bookshelf. Onto the cult, if you believe you'll be saved. Ridiculous, isn't it? Yeah, same the same thing. That dialogue does seem familiar. So let's not keep Nozomi waiting any longer and go hang out with him once again. Since we are getting close to ending his social league, we might be able to wrap that up within the coming episodes. So we'll head to Polonia Mall and go see this Gourmet King and see if we can kind of mend our relationship with him in a sense. It's not like the guy that much after we learned about him recently. And of course, the one thing this guy always wants wants to do is just go out and eat because <laughs> apparently that's all he knows what to do we're heading back to wild duck burger that's the place where we had that little disagreement for last time maybe he wants to make a beds too <laughs> hey i haven't been doing so well since last time i think it's because of those things you said against god i don't remember that i think so hard for your soul that i think i even lost weight <laughs> Uh, okay then. Yeah, oh brother. 
that's the only thing I come up with. I can't be nice about this guy now. <laughs> that's probably not gonna happen. I need more fried chicken first thing in the morning. Oh, jeez. What is your dino, Zobi? I swear. Your dino must be the most unhealthy thing that's ever existed. I like my little brother. Once again, bring up his little brother. He used to do that a lot. I'm genetically predisposed predis to spilling on my clothes. Everyone hates me. They all wish I could be more like, more like my little brother. Everyone's always making fun of me. I just want the whole world to go away right now. Man, that just seems to be like a relevant topic no matter who we talk to. This whole animal world thing. I'll try my best to make it a paradise. Then I'll have a totally sweet new body. I'll be taller and more slender, and my body will glow, so I'll be safer at night. See? Then I won't be inferior to my brother, and you won't hate to be seen with me. <laughs> so please, don't abandon me. Maybe he is turning around in a sense. We do know that he cherishes our friendship with him a lot, in the weird ways that he does show that. I think there might be some genuine feelings from him towards us. He just has a strange way of showing it. It also gets mixed in a lot with this whole paradise thing he always brings up. Well, now I think at level 8 with him now. I have to leave without eating because I haven't earned forgiveness just yet. I still have to find... A new believer first. I guess he's still working on this whole paradise thing. Oh, wait a second. Yeah, that's him. So, I can count on you? Yeah, it's not a problem so long as I get my money. Actually, I know this other guy who's been short on cash lately. I'm willing to pay for two guys. Just make sure it gets done. 130... 2,000 yen, right? Yeah, that's the same thing that happened to my son. God, how much... How did Nozomi come across that kind of money? How many kids he con out to, to get that much yen? Stay away from that kid if you don't want to get caught in his trap. Well, things might not be looking good for Nozomi in the future. Looks like that middle-aged guy is gonna be making his move. It's... I probably it's hired on some, uh... Oh, hey. Other kids to do his bidding, I suppose. Have you noticed those weird symbols and posters all over town? Yeah. How can you not notice them? They're all over the place. Nick's supposed to be affecting everyone's mind. We should go to Tartarus. We were just at Tartarus recently, Yukari. We need some time to rest up, but we will be back there soon. Here's a poster all over town. Say that again. Someone could go talk to Koromaru, huh? What are you doing today, boy? Why not move for a walk? Alright then. Jupei, anything different to say? Nope. I'm just gonna head back to bed again. And, no, not save. Not just yet. I just started. <laughs> now it's not the time to go save. Huh? Let's go back to my room and then go turn in earlier once again because there's nothing else to do at night. And I can't depend on Coral Mar to go walking all the time. I mean, there's only so much fresh air he wants to get before he gets tired too. Now it's the fifth. And the plans could be the same as last time. Just go hang on Nozobi since he's literally the only thing we could do right now. The only social that's available to us. And of course Akinor is only available on Sunday so we can't rely on him yet. Maybe everyone will change their dialogue now that another day has passed. Let's see, let's see. Aki? As you know, whatever occurs during the dark hours is acknowledged, it's acknowledged differently by the public. That includes atta attacks by shadows. So if a person is found injured, the attack is usually blamed on a robber. And if someone disappears, it's considered a kidnapping or abduction. These incidents are sporadic and are classified as mysterious cases because everything about them is unexplainable. But now the numbers 
the number of incidents are increasing so fast that they're drawing the public's attention. So in a sense, the dark hours are becoming a lot more chaotic, I guess, in terms of cause and effect. That's probably what it's getting at. I wonder if anyone actually thinks that's true. It kind of reminds me of those advertisements at the back of a magazine. You know, the ones that say, but this product, buy this product and you'll be happier. I guess, in a sense, Ken. But not really, though. Kormarzan has very good eyes. We'll need those eyes to see through the lies of that cult. Well, red eyes like that, I'm pretty sure you can see through anything. School starting again. I wonder how everyone's doing. Eh, they're probably the same, hopefully. That's true, the vacation wasn't long enough for anyone to change. That is a good point. It's been like barely two weeks since we've been off break. Or off school to be off break. Cases of apathy syndrome were on the rise again. There have been a lot of people reported missing as well. Oh boy. Yeah, that's not good at all. Society is crumbling before our very eyes. Day by day, it seems that the fall is making things a lot worse. Or at the very least, Nick says. And we're so interested, interested in the cult. There are news reports on it every single day. It makes me sick. I hope our school will be like that. She'll be okay, Yukar. We just gotta have faith. Just gotta hope for the best that the people that we have been friends with at Gecko High are a lot smarter than that. The cult members talk about salvation and deliverance. But people have different ways they, they want to be saved. Some people want money. Others want peace. I wonder what the cult members want. I'm pretty sure we all know what they really want, Fuka. There's no two ways about that. In the end, this old apathy syndrome, apathy syndrome patient died due to malnutrition. This man was the first patient that the young doctor was not able to save. Tears rolled down its face. That was our special report. Coming up next, the news. I thought that was the news. <laughs> That's just depressing news as it is. Okay, I'm pretty sure I spoke to everyone, so we're gonna go hang on with Nozomi again, since like I said, he's the only thing that's worthy of doing these days. So one bad thing about this break is that it limits our activities with social links. It's a shame that we can't hang out with Mizuru, even though we're in the same door with her all the time. I know, Zomi. What are we gonna get up to today? Go to the strip mall. Well, we didn't go anywhere with him last time because he still hasn't, in his words, earned forgiveness. <laughs> Maybe this time things will be different. Hey, Mikado. He's more energetic than usual. I did it. I finally met my quota. I found someone else to welcome to our flock. Technically, I never really accepted going into paradise, did I? I don't think I did. But at least he's found maybe two people to go to paradise with them. Oh wow, you're interested in joining too? Finally, paradise is smiling on me! Really, Nozomi? Just stop it. Just stop, man. Y you think I should abandon these people with their sin? I don't really think they're that sinful, though they're not... They don't look like the nicest guys you'll ever meet. Of course, you can't understand. You're good looking enough that everything is handed to you. You're not like us. If if that's how you really feel, Makoto, then we're through. Don't follow me around. Only true believers are allowed into paradise. He's really caught up in this whole paradise thing. My goodness. That person seems familiar, though. Out of concern, you decide to follow him. That knows always gonna get himself in a bad situation one of these days. And that might be today. <laughs> wow, way to call it. Way to call it, Blue. Way to call it. But well, what? Th this is... An emergency! A serious emergency! They're gonna talk about the end of the world some more. I remember another call that got into that. Except they were really about initiation fees. I think it was just giving up material wealth. A lot of these cults just borrow ideas from other actual religions, don't they? Tell the truth. 
Y you mean this was all a trick? How is it different from you tricking my son? You went too far, kid. I tried to do this civilly, but I don't even feel bad anymore. Try to hit his face. If he gets scars, then he'll be able to press charges or something. Uh, uh, am I gonna die? I... I... But, but if I die here, I'll be, come back as an angel and... Man, no, Zoe, it's not, it's not the time to talk about reincarnation, that kind of stuff. You're about to get beaten up. Ah, jeez, he's getting snot everywhere. And sure enough, Okoto comes to the rescue. And once again, Okoto goes right behind us, because he knows who his true friends are. Yeah, even though you said all those bad things, Ozobi, I still came to your aid because I'm a good guy. Ozobi really seems to trust you. This guy really has a hard way of making friends, but... We've been nice to him enough, long enough, I guess, that he does really trust us. Or maybe because Makoto's just that much of a good-hearted person, he just didn't want to see Ozobi get hurt. <laughs> Either way... We're not rank 9 already with Nozobi and his social link. We made a lot of fast progress with him in the last couple weeks. Hopefully this guy has finally learned the errors of his ways. Look, we gotta take off. I have work and this is a drag. And then it goes, there, there those guys go, just having to go meet other obligations. Look, just forget about the money, but I don't ever want to see your face near my son again. And there he goes. Oh, Makoto, you're such a nice guy. I have talked to Nozobi home, we return to the dorm. Well, hopefully Nozobi will know who his true friends are, not try to buy, buy his way into other friendships. That seems to be what he was doing. Puka, how you doing tonight? I'm just talking about the same thing. I wonder who I didn't talk to. I know I talked to Puka. I know I talked to you, you, and you, and we used you two. I think I spoke with everyone here. Pretty sure I did. Maybe Carl's gonna be up for walking again tonight. No, it's not. Just rather hang out with Agus. That's good. Good enough for him. At least those two seem to get along quite a bit, does I guess and Koro. So we'll head back to our rooms again and just go sleep earlier. <laughs> it's always the same thing the last few uh, few months when it comes to social stuff. Ever since we maxed out our traits, that's all we really can do. That or just walk Koro if he's it available to go walk with still. This is kind of a routine at this point for us just to just go to bed earlier. Okay, the 6th of January. We're gonna go meet with Nozobi again, but this time we don't have enough points to finish up his social link. This is gonna be another regular hangout with session with him. Huh? Before I go meet him at Polonia Ball again, Pretty sure these guys are saying the same thing again. Yeah, I'm sure they are. So the only thing that's gonna be different around here is just checking the TV. Every channel is showing news related to Apathy Syndrome. That's nothing new actually. It's just different takes on the same topic. So we'll head to Polonium Mall and go meet with Nozomi again. But like I said, this time we're accumulating social link points towards his link, since we don't have enough to finish his link. And maybe for once we'll actually go and eat out with him, because the last two meets we have with him, we haven't done that. So we're off to the ramen shop with him. And it's just the two of us hanging out. It was better that just for us to just hang out, then Nozomi get himself into... Another beating, that's for sure. And the next time we do meet with him, we'll be able to finish up his social link. And I think I'm going to save that for next time. 
I know oh, this no. is a shorter and less eventful episode than what we usually go through, but this is pretty much par for the course when it comes to Social League stuff. Uh, especially if you're doing a max Social League run, you're gonna come into this routine of hanging out with people, then going to bed earlier if you max your traits, and just repeating that process again for the next little bit. These kind of things do happen when you're going through this kind of game. So I think we are going to wrap things up for today since, once again, everyone has nothing else for us to to talk to about. So next time on Persona 3 FES, we're going to end off Nozomi Social League after we get another phone call. What's it get from Mitsuru? That's the second time this week. I still don't think I can squeeze you in, Mitsuru. Sorry, got to turn you down again. Oh, that's so hurtful. I can't believe I just not the right place right now to to hang out with Mitsuru on Sundays because because we still have Akinari to hang out with on that day. But still, it hurts that we can't do that with Mitsuru yet. Hopefully, that chance will come again in the future. But for now, we're gonna end things off like I said. Next time, we're gonna end off Nozobi Social League since we have enough points accumulated to well end off this link. And see where things go from there. Hopefully winter break won't last any longer because quite frankly, I'm kind of missing our school social league buddies, not gonna lie. Until we meet again, farewell for now.